Okay, greetings fam, this is Kenny with Tarot. Say what? I'm over here eating this. Um, of course, I could have like just not ate before I turned the camera on, but eating my favorite candy, Milk Duds, and about to do an un uh, unboxing to that. Uh, curious, my family and friends, what's your favorite candy? I'm a, mi mi uh, I'm a Milk Duds fanatic. I love Milk Duds. And the thing is, I just got my teeth cleaned yesterday, so I probably shouldn't be eating this, but I love those dads. Anyway, so let's do this. Um, I have been sitting on this deck, and I don't know why I haven't gone through it, but today I will. This is a deck that this is a deck that I supported off of Kickstarter, and I think it's called a Spacious Tarot. Um, we'll see once I get into this box. Anyway, my family and friends, do me a favor. If you're not following my account on TikTok and Instagram, do so right now. If you haven't, hit that subscribe button over on YouTube. Make sure you do that right now. Okay, so yeah, this is the deck I just picked up. Or not just picked up, but it's something I supported off of Kickstarter. It's from Spacious Creations. So I think it must be the Spacious Tarot. And we're going to get into it. So the box had these two items in it. It looks like this is a guidebook, I don't know. Maybe separate. I hope that's not the case. I like a guidebook that can fit in there. No, this is an expansion deck. Oh, okay, I think I'm remembering what this is about. Okay, so this is the Spacious Tarot. Oops, the light is blinding. The Spacious Tarot, so here's that. And this deck was created, this is the second edition that came out in 2020, so maybe I didn't support this off Kickstarter. It's from Malin. Rugged? Rugged? Hmm. I don't even know where I supported this deck off of. Where I where and how and why. Hmm. I don't know. Someone can tell me. So, 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 so. Okay, so first we're gonna go ahead and open up this deck. Just to kind of get in the inside, because I really want to know why did I purchase this um deck? I don't know. This is the Spacious Tarot from Malin Ruggets. And it's an immersive 78 card deck with an 137 page guidebook. Um, hashtag the Spacious Tarot, or you can visit the spaciousTarot.com. It says it's a deck for the second edition from 2020, so it shouldn't be a Kickstarter campaign. Um, we will see. This is Malin Ragged here, and in the inside the book it says. Carrie Mallon and Annie Rugged. Oh, their last names. Duh. Okay. These are two different people. Um, looks like this is a deck by Carrie Mallon and Annie Rugged. I was thinking this one person. <laughs> yes. Okay. So the concepts are by Carrie Mallon and Annie Rugged. And it's written by Carrie Mallon and illustrated by Annie Rugged. And this is the second edition, copyright 2020. So. The guidebook is just a short little guidebook. But here's the thing, my friends. There is an expansion deck, and I'm not even quite sure what the expansion deck is. So let's go ahead and, and look at that real quick. Again, if you're not following me on Instagram and TikTok, do me a favor and do so. Hit that subscribe button over on YouTube. And I will say that I'm so grateful. Like, there has been... A lot of people that have lately have come on board. So keep spreading the word, my friends, and glad that you're a part of my journey. Okay, so this has an expansion. Expansion. I don't know if it's an expansion deck or what it is, but. Hmm. And there's an expansion guidebook. Okay, so maybe there's additional cards. Okay, about the expansion pack. It says the concepts come from an uh, old Italian car system called the Minchetti. I don't know. Minchiate? I don't know. M I N C H I A T E. I'll look it up and see how they pronounce it. Although related to tarot, uh, this utilizes several extra cards. Typically, these additional cards represent the classical elements and virtues, <clears throat> plus the 12 zodiac signs. 
Although inspired by that order system, this is not an exact replication. This expansion pack includes 21 cards, starting with the four elements and 12 zodiac signs, much like the older decks. Instead of the classical virtues, we've included five value cards, each representing the concept we feel resonates with the interjected realm and spacious tarot, curiosity, connection, offering, transcendence, and spaciousness. How to use this deck. You can work with the expansion pack on its own as a standalone deck or by combining it entirely with tarot. So let's go ahead and just quickly look at this. Um, this is going to be the expansion, um, the expansion deck. Um, okay, so let's just look at this really quick. We have air. I'm going to flip through them because I want to get to the actual deck. Earth, fire. Great card style. Great card style. And then we have the different signs. Aries, uh, Taurus, Gemini, Cancer, Leo, Virgo, Libra, Scorpio, Sagittarius. My birthday's December 7th, so hey, that's my uh Capricorn, Aquarius, Pisces, Curiosity. These are the five uh virtues or five uh connection, offering, transcendence, and spaciousness okay so <clears throat> that's what this expansion pack is it has a beautiful guidebook as well so be sure to check that out i am or sorry it has a beautiful guidebook as well so be able to check so be sure to check that out i'm gonna lay that to the side so we can quickly get into these cards um this says this space is for you yes <clears throat> okay my friends I'm going to do this in a way, hopefully, that I can reduce this light that is not really working for me right now. Okay, so here are the cards, my friend. So we have the Fool. Magician. The High Priestess. The Empress. The Emperor, the Hierophant, the Lovers, the Chariot, the Strength, the Hermit, the Will of Fortune, Justice, like that, being alone in the abyss, uh -huh. the Hanged One, Death. Um, <clears throat> what do I think about this deck so far? I mean, I'm liking the, you know, this sense of spaciousness that it's going with, with all these natural elements for the most part. Um, you're not seeing, um, people, um, in these cards. Um, the moon, the sun, and I think it's a pretty intuitive deck, um, for the most part, for some of them. I'm not quite sure about the others. And then we have the world. It's beautiful colors, my friends. Beautiful, beautiful colors. Um, <clears throat> so I'm just going to keep flipping through these because it seems like it's going to be a long video. Um, Four Pentacles. Four Pentacles. Five Pentacles. Six of Pentacles. I'm saying it's pretty intuitive, but <clears throat> I wonder, you know, of course, I want that you should have some knowledge of tarot if you want those interpretations, but I guess you can read it in any kind of way that you want, as long as it's useful to you. Um, and so here, I, I didn't mention this, but the core cards are changed. This is the child of pentacles. And then we have the explorer of pentacles. Then we have the guardian of pentacles. And then we have the Elder of Pentacles. I mean, those are pretty straightforward um, uh, names of the court cards um, that I think you can kind of walk away with something. Um, let's go to the Swords. The Ace of Swords. Two of Swords. The Three of Swords. 
Something's breaking. Here's that four of swords. Okay, I'm getting the conflict in this. Five of swords. I mean, it's a, it's a nice deck. I'm, I like the illustrations. Beautiful. <clears throat> Seven of swords. Eight of swords. I like this whole winter is coming. Winter is coming motif. Nine of swords. Ten of swords. And let's look at the child of swords. The explorer of swords. The guardian of swords. And the elder of swords. <coughs> Excuse me. Something has gone down the wrong way since earlier. Um, <clears throat> Oh, these are nice. Look at that. That's the Ace of Wands. Beautiful deck. It's a. It's this is a beautiful deck. Um, it's a beautiful deck. I'm liking the colors. I'm liking the, this flat appeal of them. I'm liking this card finish. I'm liking the card stock. Um, so there are some things I really really like. You know, um, some cons. I guess if I haven't had any, um, I wonder. Do you pick up the meaning on the, on these decks? There must have been a reason why I purchased this or that this deck is coming across. So I'm excited to figure out when <clears throat> when I order this deck. It must have been kickstart. It must have been. Now these are cups. That's a beautiful cup. Ace of cups. Two of cups. Three of cups. Four of cups. I like this five of cups. Look at that. Look at that. We got six of clubs. <clears throat> the seven of cups. This is a nice eight of cups. You know, look at that. This path away. Look at that. Or two, depending on how you're looking at this. Look at that. <laughs> look at that. Oh, this is must be my favorite card. Look at this ten of cups. I like that. Look at the harmony in that. I love that. That's really nice. Okay. Child of Cups, the Explorer of Cups, the Guardian of Cups, and the Elder of Cups. So I like this deck. This is actually a cute deck. Um, <clears throat> it's one that I think that I would probably spend some time with thinking about the cards, the images that I'm seeing, taking the knowledge that I have, and being able to apply it um, in this context. I really want another Milk Dud. Okay, I'm having another milk bud. I'm sorry. Listen, while I eat this milk bud, if you're not following me on Instagram or TikTok, go ahead and do so right now. Also, if you haven't hit that subscribe button yet on YouTube, go ahead and hit it. I'm almost with the need. Almost. I'm not quite there yet. I'm just going to swallow. Just going to swallow. Okay. <clears throat> okay. So, did you like? Did you comment? Did you reshare? Did you subscribe? Okay. So, these will be the cards that I'm going to be using my friends today. So, let's just stop for a second. Hmm. I realized I was in my face until I it hit me. Whew. Okay, so. <clears throat> what do we need to know about this situation? Wow, card just fell out. Okay. What do we need to know about today and how it's influencing us? What is it? There we go. Okay. And... Okay, okay, what can we expect in the future? Okay, we're gonna go to two cards that fell out. <clears throat> Let's see. Okay, my friends, these are going to be the cards that I will be using today. A bunch of cards fell out, but I'll use the four that are here. I'm um, using the, this deck today. And again, I'm using the Spacious Tarot. This deck was developed by Carrie Mallon and Annie Ruggett. I hope I'm saying your name right. But I'm so grateful for this deck. Um, please, please, please be sure to support 
our independent artists and those who are supporting the tarot community. Okay, my friends, these will be the cards today and I'll post some videos a little bit later. The first card in the past position is the Five of Pentacles. Check that out. The second card in the present position is the Fool. And the third card in the future position is the Four of Wands. Okay, my friends and family, let's, 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 yeah, I'm looking forward to yeah, I'm looking forward to this, my friends. Check back a little bit later, and I'll have some videos posted. I love you. My teeth look clean. I got them clean. They look good. Anyway, I love you, my friends. Check back later.